Yeah, David Kalina, the resolution before the Clark County Commission today would declare all uh, misinformation and disinformation related to the coronavirus a public health crisis, potentially clearing the way for more concrete policies to come. The resolution does not define what misinformation is, but says that the practice has significantly undermined public health efforts and created a culture of mistrust that has drawn out the pandemic. It says that COVID has had a major impact on health, safety, and Clark County's economy, as the region has seen more than 400,000 cases and 6,600 deaths as of September 1st. The CDC says that less than half of adults between 18 and 24 are, vac or are vaccinated, and many TikTok influencers who have joined the Biden administration to push for vaccines say that misinformation is a key reason that many young adults are turning the shot down. You have people that are also influencers, they're solely anti-vax influencers, you like Dr. Joseph Morcola, who have built, you know, $100 million massive business, um, essentially promoting disinformation about vaccines online. Just recently, Facebook banned an entire network that was actually paying influencers to post vaccine disinformation. Uh, if the resolution is passed, county commissioners would declare health misinformation a crisis. The group would also be committed to fighting misinformation and curbing the spread of falsehoods that could, quote, threaten the health and safety, end quote, of people living in southern Nevada. Now, it is worth noting that a yes vote on a resolution is not the same thing as passing a law. It's not really binding, but it could clear the way for more action down the road. Sean Delancey, 13 Action News.